Hey guys, how's it going? I hope you're having a... I try and think of something other than great or fantastic. I hope you're having a good day. There we go. Hope you're having a good day. Uh, today I have another mystery box video for you. This is just an unboxing. Um, yeah, I, I just want to apologise if you can hear this noisy thing behind me. It is so warm. If you can't tell, I'm all red. It is so warm today and it's been so cold. It's just... All of a sudden, it's just really sticky and humid and ugh. Um, so today I have another mystery box by Cosmetic Capital. I will leave their website in the description box. This, so they had two releases for this month. Technically, it's Mar it was March. I only received it today, which is the 1st of April, but this was from March. They had a women's cosmetic one, which I've also got. I'm going to do a video on that later. And they had like a uh, body product one as well and that's the one I'm going to be doing for you today so this is the box it's actually huge I've got the cosmetic one if I can just reach over oh god that is the size difference it is significantly bigger I think it's it's deeper as well so it's it's a lot. I mean, I suppose it has to be. Oh God, sorry, that was probably very loud. So, anyway, let's get to unboxing. Of course, tissue paper. And this is what I can see. Um, I'm fairly sure it's all body kind of stuff, but I suppose we'll see. What's this? It's a product by Garnier. This is the. Botanical Cleansing Sponge. Deeply cleanses and gently exfoliates skin. Wet sponge before use. But, I mean, it's rock. So I'm going to have to get this out to have a look. It looks like um, polystyrene with a or a round tampon. Okay, so you soak it, rub it on your face, rinse it out, hang it up. Apparently, or soak in warm water for three minutes. Okay, so interesting. I probably will use it. It's not too harsh. It feels all right. Yeah, cool little random sponge. Woohoo! Next. Ah, uh, yeah, this is an Emco Beauty Fruity Beauty 2 in 1 lip treatment in the fragrance apple. And it's also like a lip gloss as well. So I don't think I'll keep this in the box. I don't think I'd use that. I really don't think I'd use that because I don't like that sort of thing. Lip balms? Yes. Lip oils, lip glosses, stuff like that? No. I don't. I don't like that sort of thing, so I'm going to keep that in the box and I'm going to give that one away. But I can see a lip balm. Maybelline Baby Lips SPF 20 Lip Balm in the scent Lychee Addict. I do like a lychee. If I can get it out of the packaging. I hope you guys can hear the music too. I did turn it up a bit because the fan is so loud, but hopefully it's loud enough, but not... I can't get this out. Hopefully it's loud enough, but not too oh, loud. Oh, come on. Oh, seriously. Oh, there we go. Anyway. It's a very pale pink sort of shade. It does sort of smell like a lychee, actually. Mm. Nice lip balm. And as I've said before, you cannot have enough lip balms. So definitely keeping that one. What's this? I can see a little tub of something. Oh, this is a Neutrogena Purifying Boost Clay Mask. I've not had a clay mask before, so I might try that tonight. Very nice. I can see this one as well. This one is intriguing. This is... Elf Active Workout Ready Hydration Stick. 
hydration stick. Is it like a deodorant? Directions. Twist up the stick and glide onto skin like the face, hands or elbows in upward motions. Blend with your finger. This is what it looks like. I mean, it, is, it does look nice. I don't know what that is. Hydration stick. Active hydration stick. But it, face, hands or elbows in, an up, in upwards motions. Absolutely no idea what that entails, but I will figure it out. Put that back in the box. Right. This one is next. Ah, another Garnier Organics. Rich Argan... I'm guessing that's Argan Oil. Multi-use rescue balm for face, body and hands. It's a vegan formula with organic argan oil and organic shea butter for dried out and rough areas. So it sounds like it's like a little moisturiser with argan oil in it. There we go. Oh, it's, yeah, so it's like, a, it's like a cream, yeah. It's not too thick. And it spreads out quite nicely and it smells nice so yeah I'll be definitely using that one awesome Do we have another one oh no this is the Neutrogena sheer zinc face dry touch sunscreen lotion for sensitive skin directions apply liberate liber I can't talk. I can't say this word. L apply liber liberary. You know what I mean. Uh, to all exposed areas, 15 to 20 minutes before sun exposure. This would be really good for work, actually. Uh, reapply frequently at least every two hours and after swimming, ex excessive perspiration, toweling, or prolonged sun exposure. So, yeah, that would be really good um, for when I'm at work. And it just looks like a pretty sanded little sunscreen. And it smells like a sunscreen. So fantastic. I have some sunscreen. Do we even have sunscreen? Well, I know I think we've got like the spray spray sunscreen. Nothing like a lotion one. We've got one in bubble wrap. I really hope you guys saw that because bubble wrap just went flying and it was a little bit amusing. Um, I didn't expect to get anything in bubble wrap in this one. Maybe it, the bottle is like glass. So this is the In Essence Aromatherapy Skin Therapy Soothing Facial Treatment Oil with Organic Camellia Caladula lavender and chamomile for sensitive skin directions after cleansing massage two to three drops it's glass it's got to have a little pipette thing on it um is that what they call the little squeezy pipette things i think that's really cool um massage two to three drops directly into the face and neck area use morning and evening as a treatment or or before applying moisturizer otherwise for added hydration combine a few drops with your favorite moisturizer I don't have particularly dry skin. That's the problem. Like I find like a lotion or a, a decent moisturizer works well for me. So I don't, I don't know if I need this. Let's, let me see if I can grab it out and have a look at it. So I can, I can at least show it to you guys. Oh, and look, it comes with instructions. Oh, it's quite a large bottle actually. That's really nice. You can't see it, but it's like, it's got like um white sort of sticky outy flowers on it but yeah i don't know if i need that i i mean i suppose there's no harm in keeping it through the winter i might get a bit drier through the winter so yeah i'll hold on to that one now we've got a, a, a bag of something a bag let me move this box out of the way uh, oh, open my bag oh we have a Dove Deeply Nourishing Body Wash. Very nice. Can I open this easily? 
you will, if you watch my last mystery box video, you would have, you've noticed today that I didn't get Mick to open every, anything because I couldn't, you know, and then I wanted to open things as well, so it just ended up in a complete disaster. Oh gosh, complete disaster. Mm, I thought it was going to have like a squeezy pump or something on it, but mm, that smells really good. Yay! Oh, <laughs> I, was, I was actually wondering if I was going to get any more of this. It's more body scrub by, I believe it's by Milk. And it is a turmeric, aloe vera, rosehip oil, coconut shell, lavender oil, and cinnamon bark oil body scrub. I, I had one of these that was just about to run out. And in that video I was talking about before, the um, mystery box one. Um, the one where I made my own mystery box. I need to stop saying um. I uh, almost said it again. I got two of these. So I was like, yeah, you know, no, I got one of these and one of two of another one or something like that. And I was like, oh, cool. I'm never going to run out now. And then when I got this box, I was like, oh, gosh, am I actually going to get any more of this sort of thing? I don't really need any more. But it means I don't have to go out and spend lots of money on it. I can't get this open, but I know what it smells like and I will be keeping a hold of it. So, And lastly, we have more hair stuff, I believe. Another Garnier. Oh. That came off really easily. Another Garnier product. Garnier Organics. Another vegan product. This is a nourishing mist. Again, with organic argan oil and organic cornflower water for dry, sensitive skin. Um, does it have directions? What's inside? I'm guessing it's like a moisturizing spray that you use I, I'm, 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 I'm guessing because there's no real like directions or anything on it so oh I forgot to say this box cost me $30 uh, and I can't remember what the value was but it's a, I think it, they're usually about $240 $250 and I bought both of these mystery boxes at the same time so I've got a free free product I'll just quickly show you what it is. I've got a couple of lip kit things. These are by Model Co. They're lip lacquer liquid lipstick. I've got two. One in the shade Casablanca and one in the shade Morocco. If you want to see me potentially testing them, watch the uh, next pink box, cosmetic capital mystery box video. It'll be in that. But yeah, this... Hang on. I want to sniff it. I don't know if that smells very pleasant. I might see if my dad wants that. He, he likes stuff like this. Like it doesn't even say where it's... Oh, hang on. For dry sensitive skin. I was going to say it doesn't say where it's for, but it's for your skin. So, yeah. I might find... See if my dad wants that. He loves that sort of thing. So, yeah. Um, I'm going to keep trying to get this off. Uh, yeah, sorry. Distracting myself. I hope you enjoyed this video. Just a quick little unboxing. I'm probably going to record the other box after I do this one. Oh, uh, so yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed it. I will leave. Oh, that's just such a racket. Um, I will leave Cosmetic Capitals um, website in the description box below. My hair. And now that it's April, I'm like I'm recording this on the first of April. So now that it's April, I'm going going to assume that they've got more mystery boxes coming out. I think. So yeah, I'll I'll probably be purchasing purchasing them. But I'm thinking about doing some more like generalized mystery boxes. Um, and I've got a few makeup challenges and uh, videos coming up. So yeah, keep tuned. Hit the subscribe button so you don't miss it. Hit the like button. Thumbs up. If you, uh, you know, you like this one, you guys know the drill. Um, you should by now. <laughs> All right, guys. Thanks for watching, and I will see you in the next one.